Hi everyone, this is Ola from Career Angels and I'm here today to talk to you about the hidden job market on LinkedIn and more specifically when we talk about the hidden job market we focus on job ads which are um, published on LinkedIn but in non-obvious places so difficult to find places um, and aimed at senior international candidates so they're published in English and focused on people with at least 10 years of experience, very often managerial experience as well. Um, and we actually have a, a LinkedIn group called the Hidden Job Market for Experienced Managers in Europe. And today I'm going to show you a couple of examples from um, a weekly selection of job ad gems, so hidden job market gems that we publish on the group. Let's have a look at today's examples and I'll tell you a bit more in a moment. Our first example today takes us to Denmark and it's particularly interesting for people who are passionate about renewable energy solutions. Um, a company called Kaui is looking for their head of section offshore wind based in Denmark. Um, so this is a company which has been active since the 1980s and has already uh, been involved in over a thousand wind power projects in uh, 70 countries. They are an international organization, so the team is also international. 125 people from Denmark, but also Germany, Norway, Taiwan, the UK and North America. And they're looking for someone to oversee um, the, uh, the team um, to also manage projects. Um, so this has to be someone who has a really good business understanding, someone who's very good at managing people. So uh, really integrating people cross-functionally, internationally, culturally, um, and also integrating knowledge. So making sure that the knowledge isn't really sort of um, fragmented and um, um, yeah. Now, um, in terms of technical uh, skills and knowledge, you should have a degree in civil engineering. You should also have relevant experience, so at least 10 years of experience in uh, offshore projects as well. If you click apply on LinkedIn, you will be taken outside of LinkedIn um, and you will end up on a success factors uh, application platform, which means that the first screening of CVs will be done through an applicant, uh, applicant tracking system. I'll tell you a bit more about it in a second. Um, the second example, also, uh, as you will see uh, in a moment, done through uh, an applicant tracking system, is based in uh, Milan, Italy. The employer is Gucci, so we're in the world of luxury goods. Um, Gucci are looking for their hub marketing manager, and the mission of this specific position is to first develop and then deliver integrated and localized marketing and communication strategy strategies. So this is someone who will uh, really build up the Gucci brand, <clears throat> sorry, image um, and connect with clients. This is also someone who will <clears throat> manage a team. Um, in order to do that, the successful candidates would need to have at least 10 years of uh, relevant experience. So marketing, brand management experience in retail or luxury retail, fluent English and Italian. So this is part of an international organization, but local, well, working locally in Italy, good at public speaking and interesting, uh, interestingly enough, proficient with Microsoft Office. This, this seems like a self-explanatory thing. It's so obvious that a lot of people don't even have it on their LinkedIn profiles. If you do want to work with the LinkedIn algorithm and with ATS algorithms, if you see employers actually mentioning Microsoft Office as a desired skill, even if it's for C-level jobs, which I've seen happen, and clients actually have asked me about this, uh, do include it in your profile. It's a small thing. It's worth having this because algorithms don't really distinguish between high-level skills and um, basic office skills. If you click apply here for this job on LinkedIn, again, you will be taken outside. And this particular applicant tracking system, um, which will screen your CV, is called is run or um, provided by my workday job. So, um, like success factors, it's a major provider of ATS. If you want to know more about ATS, we actually have developed a step by step guide to preparing ATS compliant CVs. You can find it on our blog. You can also very much uh, outsource the job to you to us we uh, prepare um, ATS compliance fees for our clients. Um, the two job ads that I showed you today are published as a part of a larger selection. Um, we actually 
post a weekly post on the LinkedIn group um, and it contains a link to our blog where the full selection is uh, published. It's over 40 job ads this week, so you're very welcome to check this out. Mm, now, on our website, uh, you can also find two really interesting things that we offer for free, free career consultations, free CV reports. They're really easy to set up. There's a contact form on the website, so do, do, do take a look. And finally, Hidden Job Market for Experienced Managers in Europe. That's the name of the LinkedIn group. If you know someone who would like to join, all they need to do is send us a request. If they're a senior manager, we'll be very happy to have them on board. That's it from me today. If you have any questions or comments, do um, well, leave me a comment or send me a message. Otherwise, a very, very, very good week. And see you next week. Bye-bye.